So January 2019's prep of the month is medical and I'm using this month to just really dive down into my medical gear and my supplies, see what I've got, see what I need, see what's going out of date, see you know what needs to be topped off in the individual um, first aid kits and the daily drivers and stuff like that. And one thing I want to talk about today, the thing I want to talk about today is uh, hemostatic agents, uh, bleed stoppers. You know, the, you've got your um, quick clot, and you've got your C-LOX, and your HEMCON. They're all uh, hem hemostatic agents, hemostats, hemostatics. And um, they're made to stop major bleeding, and, and they do it a couple ways. I think the quick clot somehow, magic or witchcraft, it, it encourages the body's natural clotting process, something like that. Sealox, it does uh, something a little different. They use ground up shrimp shell to uh, cause the blood to clot into kind of a fake scab very quickly. And the products you see here are kind of like Sealox. I'm not sure if they use uh, shrimp shell. I think they may use some sort of quartz. I don't know where I read that. Uh, don't get me to lying. But it's the same basic thing. Now you see, one says bleed stop, one says stops bleeding. They're the same product. I did just enough research to know that they, they're the same product. That's the older package, that's the newer package. Uh, used to, Lou Ferrigno endorsed it, now the guy that makes pillows endorses it. Either way, these are very inexpensive ways of getting a Celox type hemostatic agent into your preps, your first aid kits, and your trauma kits. And you can buy these at Walmart, believe it or not, and each one of these packages is about five bucks, like four ninety-five. Now, like I said, you can find the older packages at my Walmart. You find this package, the white package, with two twenty-gram um, pouches for the same price as this one. You find this in the camping section. You find this one, which is the newer package, and it has three packs of fifteen-gram pouches. Fifteen-gram, yeah, pouches. Same price, it's in the first aid section. I'm going to quit buying these because I noticed that these have a a, uh, uh, a best buy date or whatever the, the date is, the manufacturer date, older than these. So I'm going to go with these newer packages and that's what I would recommend to you. I also kind of like the fact that they come in three 15 gram packages rather than the two 20 gram. You're getting a little more, but that's not what it's about. You've got three packs. And that way you can you can use a 15 gram pack and see if that works before you open another pack. And um, at that at that price, you know, you can afford to use as many as you need, but um, uh, why why waste it, right? So this is basically a poor man's Celox, and um, you know I can sit here and talk about it, but does it really work? Do we have any proof that it works? <laughs> well, <laughs> it just so happens we kind of do. Now, as my five faithful subscribers know, I, I stop at nothing to provide quality content. So, I went ahead and sliced my thumb open so I could show you how this works. Now, I agree, this is not much blood. It's kind of a waste of the stop bleeding. But we're going to do it anyway and see what happens. Now, according to the directions in the literature I have uh, seen, this stuff turns into a gel. Once, oh my god, it hurts! Oh god! No, not really. Um, it turns into a gel. <laughs> and uh, and uh, creates like a, a artificial scab. Um, hmm. Maybe I'm not bleeding enough. I don't know. I guess it'll work on any blood, not just the blood in the wound. So, let's find out what it does. Um, hmm. Yeah, okay, I see it. It's, it's creating an artificial scab. And it did stop the bleeding. So, you know, when. Um, and that's just where I hit myself with a hammer yesterday. So, oh, 
Some of the blood's leaking out. Scout, don't drink my blood. There's something kind of morbid about that. Okay, well, I just, like I said, I wanted y'all to see, so I went and sliced my thumb open. You're welcome. So there you have it, folks. There's nothing I won't do to bring you quality entertainment. Uh, in case my five faithful subscribers care, I'm healing nicely. Um, I'm a good healer, and um, I just shaved off a little bit of the the fingernail, uh, the thumbnail, and the thumb, and it's coming back. Although I tell you what, there's a lot of nerves in the end of a finger or the end of a thumb. I tell you what, touch that thing, and it just ah, pie out. But um, it's healing nicely. What? 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 You want to see it? Is that what you're saying? You want to see it? Okay, you sickos. There you go. See, it's not much. It, it's just, it's in a bad place, that's all. Um, that dark thing, that's uh, that's where I hit it with a hammer like two days before I cut it. But um, I tell you what, when I do when I do flooring, I, I put myself into it. Anyway, I, uh, I appreciate you watching, and thanks for putting up with my stupidity. And keep prepping. Keep prepping. It's important now more than ever.